trying to drag me in and then try and call me a fucking stalker. Are you crazy? Well, I have to say thank you to James because bless him, he's managed to get your channel shut for two weeks. So do you know what's gonna make you look like a proper dickhead now, Eric? Now that you can't make a video about me for two weeks, see if I mention you. See if there's a video about you, unless you show up on a panel or unless you're somewhere else and somebody's been, unless it's relevant to something. But unless I'm provoked with more bullshit from you lot, see if I give a flying fuck about anything you do. All right, and then call me a stalker after two weeks if I'm fucking harassing you, you weird prick. When, if they keep, if they come to you three times, that's harassment. Yeah. Or if a phone but you see, this is, this is what I keep trying to tell people. If you come online and do a video, and you, you're mentioning those people, you are never going to have a case. Never. Okay, this is not for attention, this is not me stalking anybody, this is not me bringing up ECB, although you're all now trying to use that to get me to come out again and get involved. I'm not. I'm all right dealing with ECB, myself, my way. And Danny, and AJ, and everybody else. My way. Like fuck am I jumping on the dream team just because you hate Eric now? Yes, well done. They're a bunch of wrongers. Yes, they're pedo protectors, if not pedos themselves. Yes, well done. Well done for pointing that out. I've only been doing that for how many fucking years before you lot were even around? This oh, new place where you still can't tell anyone, like Esau can't tell anyone, like Brian can't tell anyone, like Rodney couldn't tell anyone. Like Danny, AJ, nobody can really tell anyone. Eric, well, because I called him a nonce one time after he'd made videos of my children. That Esau loves to play in slow motion and get all breathy over my little boy's hand. Everybody else has made up this thing of me, which I am not. All I've required is that I be left alone. And now, is it not apparent to everybody? I mean, how much have you seen of me? Eric's not been allowed to make any videos and they're all scared because they know I am deadly serious with them. And now I have been left alone for what? Nine or ten days pretty much? And I'm starting to get anxiety, not so I'm scared, but I have been so focused and free, I'm sleeping, I'm eating, I'm getting just the zest of life come back because I'm not under 24-7 attack and I feel like I've cleared my name as much as I can or I need to. Eric has taken down all of his videos for now. Now this is why the anxiety is creeping in and this is where the reality of the situation has to be addressed. Finally being able to live life again without looking over my shoulder because people like Eric's crap bitch are sending me messages supposedly between him and my neighbours and then watching me and having footage of me going down bins and literally explaining what was outside of my front door three flights of stairs up. This is the man that um, docks my car, my allotment, my allotment manager, my neighbour, my mum, my dad. So you guys decide what you're going to do. But I guess the big test, the big test is going to be, and I'll give you this Eric, because you, there is something you could do to kind of redeem yourself slightly. Not redeem yourself even, but just not make it worse. Show us that you have got some common sense, if nothing else, even if you've got no fucking compassion or no morals or anything else, if you've at least got common sense, your ban will be lifted in what, two or three days is it? Must be something like that, that's gone so quick, like holidays do, right? It's gone so quick, but it's been beautiful. Um, you've got a chance, 
because what, what, what could happen? One of two, well, one of three things or more. But you could now just not make another video and not put all of that shit back up. Let's see, I guess, with ECB and that lot. I guess the ball's in your court, but just sit on that fact. Is it right that even days ahead of time, I'm getting anxiety about are you going to come back into my life and just resume all this shit again? If I've forgotten one, then fucking hell, Eric, I'm making another 15 videos about how I'm a scammer and a liar again. Um, so long as they don't kick off again in the next few days when Mr. Bitch comes back off his, um, <laughs> I was going to say his holiday. Maybe he will come back off his holiday. And if Eric does end up being in Somerset and Avon, I've already spoken to them. It's covered with all of them, covered with my sergeant. You lot want to take it seriously and just start dealing with me as men in a legal capacity. It's, I mean, it's honestly, you, you profess to know everything about everything. But, I mean, Eric, haven't you got a fucking bachelor? What is it? Honours? Whatever. Aren't you supposed... Is that supposed to be in law? I think. I don't know, honestly, but you just, honestly, you're a waste of time. Eric, man up. If you're willing to hand yourself in, then you should be able to receive a letter without crying about it. Um, who else have we got? committed to what I'm doing and doing it my way and is absolutely not for attention or needing to be on YouTube at all which is kind of blowing their thesis out of the water right now because this is what they've maintained from the beginning I've desperately wanted all of this attention this is the first time I've been able to breathe because Eric's been forced to stop now that speaks volumes and it's only a few days so it's kind of going to be on him now when he comes back let's see is, is he going to go straight in for the attack again on me or you or anybody else I mean, it'd be a stupid move in my opinion, but I don't know at this point. Yeah, no, it's me. Yeah, oh, hi, James. Sorry, I'm not being rude. I didn't see you come okay. on. I didn't say hi, but I'm just making it very... And well done for striking Eric. I did put it in a video. I don't know if you saw it. I'm taking them all down pretty quick now. But... And it's taken fucking months of that to actually get them to stop. And it's only really stopped because Eric got struck, didn't he? But it's given the opportunity for me to prove I'm no fucking stalker. How could they possibly sit and call me a stalker now? Well, it must be two weeks now, touch wood. Uh, Eric has been banned, so I don't know how it's going to go. Yeah, now, Katie, that's possible. I mean, you know, I, I really hope for his own sake. Now, what they need to know. You know yeah, I mean, it's, it, what, it's already so bad, the situation. I just can't imagine how it would make sense on any level for anybody's sake at this point for them to start it up again now, you know. And then try and call me a fucking stalker. Are you crazy? So do you know what's going to make you look like a property kid now, Eric? Now that you can't make a video about me for two weeks, see if I mention you. See if there's a video about you. And let's see if I give a flying fuck about anything you do. All right, and then call me a stalker after two weeks if I'm fucking harassing you, you weird prick. And then, call me a stalker after two weeks if I'm fucking harassing you, you weird prick. And then, call me a stalker after two weeks if I'm fucking harassing you, you weird prick.